Fractions, 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 fractions. Everybody gets to fractions and they just like, ah, I hate these. Um, maybe some of you might look at this and say, ooh, cross multiplication, right? And a lot of people remember that and, and that's fine, okay? Um, I'm not going to solve this by using cross multiplication though. We'll, we'll get to that. I have videos for that. We'll talk about that when it comes. But when you take a look at this, it just says k divided by 4 equals negative 7 halves. Remember, i got to isolate my variable, so I need to use my inverse operations. So I take a look at this. What is happening to my variable? Now, this one is pretty difficult to think in your head, right? When we were doing our other uh, one-step equations, so I'm like, why do I even know how to do this? Because I can do this stuff in my head. Well, this one to me, um, I would probably have a difficult time. It would probably take me a while to think about this in my head for me to compute it. But I know by following the steps that I've been talking about, I can solve this. So k divided by 4 equals negative 7 halves. Remember, what is happening to my variable? My variable is being, my variable is being divided by 4. So the inverse operation to undo division is to multiply by 4. Okay. Well, 4 divided by 4 gives me 1. 1 times k is just going to leave me with k. So now I have k equals negative 7 divided by 2 times 4. Now, how do we multiply a fraction times a whole number, right? we got to remember that. I know a lot of us, oh, I forget. And then it's like the world's over again. Just remember to take a fraction times a whole number, convert the whole number to a fraction, and with fractions, we just multiply straight across. Numerator times numerator, which is negative 28. Denominator times denominator, which is 2. Now we have k equals negative 20 divided by 2, always reduce the fraction whenever you can, equals a negative 14. And then let's take a look at that, see if that really makes sense. If I put a negative 14 in for 4, you can say that, oh yeah, that is just doubled on this one. So they would be equivalent uh, equations as these are your solution is negative 14. Thanks.